Because I'm going back to that statement. He said, uh, if we're pushed. So he, they have their own agenda. He's saying that just in case they are being shortchanged or not being listened to, you were there. You said you sat, sat very closely to him. And perhaps there must be something uh, you, the, the, everyone was discussing, maybe away from the voting pattern, because we knew that it occurred during the discussion on the voting uh, pattern. No, it didn't. It didn't. If I, in fact, if I, the chairman should have ruled him out of order, the chairman of the conference, Justice Cruz, he should have ruled him out of order. What you are discussing when you came on that this matter was whether we should invite memoranda from the Republic. So, actually, and that's why many of us are shouting out of order. But the chairman allowed him, he gave him the floor. Actually, the chairman should have ruled him out of order because he introduced an extraneous matter that was not before the conference at that moment. Do you think if the issue of remuneration was not there, do you think that attention would have been more focused on the nation? Well, I do not even think that uh, there are people who are sitting in that hall who have the entire budget for that conference in their pockets. It's not about remuneration. It's about vested and entrenched interest over the years. Of, it's, 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 it's a battle between status quo and the need for change. Those, look, go back to 2005 and look at the Northern Agenda for 2005 for passenger conference. If you go to back to that agenda, you can see that the mindset has not shifted because in 2005, all the North came for was status quo. Existing states, existing local government, the presidential system, nothing to change. So the question is, 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 is not, is not about uh, the, whatever they call the law of is, is peanuts. I know people in that hall that all those, that, the entire budget for the conference is in their pockets. So why is it difficult to agree on a voting pattern? Because we see what happens in the National Assembly, there's yes. a stalemate, they vote. Yes. And everybody decides this is how we want to do. Yeah. Did they consider that at the conference? Well, that, that was the issue we, we were seeing. In fact, that's what, that's what we were on for three days. That in every uh, uh, area of our life, National Assembly everywhere, the threshold for majority is still first. Let, uh, I'm voting. Why should we now have 75%? And of course, and we saw the, uh, the, the old gamut of arguments from our, our brothers and, from, and sisters from the North that everybody spoke in favor of consensus or 75% is the closest thing. And that was an interesting thing. There are those who say that, okay, they rejected the composition of the conference, they rejected the modality of the missing delegates, they rejected everything, they rejected the whole idea of the conference, but they are holding on 75%, because that's where the advantage is. And if we are, if, if, if we are looking at moving Nigeria forward, it should not be my way or the highway. We should look at the best. In fact, when Lamedo said that we should be careful of Western civilization, it's because people are saying that anywhere in the world, give, bring one oh. modern country where central percent is threshold. But uh, I just wonder because security agencies will have a lot of headache now because we could come, so many comments coming through from that conference. And is there a perception that members of that conference think that look, it's, it's us and them, North and South? That cannot afford to happen, can it? That, that's what we are seeing. I mean, when I say, I've told you that the Lamy Radama is number five in the North and number four in the Caliphate. If you come on the floor of the, of, of the, of the conference to say, we, we, we are ready to work out, we have options, it's you that don't have options, we have nowhere to go. If this place is great, but we are not, moving he, elsewhere. He, he's not an elected officer. No, no, the same day, the head of the Caliphate, Sultan, went to the president. Oh, this conference is killed against the Muslim. So people are widening. But that's not the divisions. first time. In fairness, what? that's not the first time we've heard people speak like that. We've seen even there was a time Khan actually had issues and they, they went to the president. So if anybody has an issue and they go to the president, well, the president, as the president of the country, definitely will listen to them. And I think, don't you think we should just allow those who have complaints bring their complaints and let them be with their complaints? Oh, so, so you, you think that. Some of us are so happy that with the killings going on, then you, are, that, that, why, why, then, didn't, why didn't you make that the first thing? We are saying that, look, you don't pollute the atmosphere before we start discussing. They have, they have by now, because they have, they have weeks, sharpened, because they have sharpened divisions. Because two weeks now, Mr. Yes. Odumaki, and yes. we still haven't actually seen any progress, so to speak, because, tangible pro progress. Yeah, because, because we, are, we are saying two weeks, 53 years, where is the progress? 
three years after independence. No, Hundred years after West Bukas. That is why they so have. That's that is why. That is why. Fundamental issues we have to deal with. Yeah, that is why I'm sure that Nigerians are happy that we've been able to constitute about 492 people yeah. that can actually sort out the rot of 52 years, mm. and we say. Well, this time we have to be serious about it because in any case, there was also the issue of people sleeping in the conference yeah. and people well, kicking against uh, such being televised so that people don't even know that they're not there for real business. Are we ready to sort out the rot of 52 years? That's, that, 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 that's the question. And that's why so many some of us spoke on that matter that, look, we cannot ask the president to do their job. If, 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 if the only way you can stop the media from reporting that you are sleeping is not to sleep. So, so the media has to, to keep you awake. Okay, but, uh, so, but, you see, except leaders across the divide agree that we have issues we have to deal with. I mean, I do not expect in the midst of what has gone on in this country for responsible leaders to come together and not to focus on issues like we are saying and not be focusing on okay. the question of where other places to go to. The over how do we vote? What about the outcome of the conference? Because some ask, if it's going to be subject or sent to the National Assembly, why have the National Conference? Why don't we just send our views to members of the National Assembly? Let them pass it after all. Well, you, you can also see that uh, that's one of the issues that came up early in the conference about what happens, what's the final destination of this all. And there are people who are saying that. Uh, Oh, we are just an advisory committee. We are this and this. Why should anybody go and waste three months of his life if you are merely just to advise? Uh -huh. The president has enough advisors. He can as well ask his body of advisors and rest to advise him and give him a paper. I think that those who are saying that do not understand what's at stake. I, can, I want to assure you that there is no way this conference will not take a life of its own. And because this last ditch effort to pull this place right. Okay, let's and the Tasha committee are waiting for what to happen in this country. Let's bring this in for those who may have misconceptions. Yeah. Sharif Abalogun says to ask you, are you biased against Islam? I'm not. I'm not. But I'm not biased against Islam. But let nobody at this stage come and use religion to intimidate anybody. Okay. That's what they're saying. All right, Nico Domangue is a delegate at the ongoing national conference. Thank you for coming on this morning. Thank you. We'll return after this break. Please join us again.